I know that you fear that these people will turn against you, but you need not worry. You are well-equipped and seasoned adventurers. Even if this land is not familiar to you, you have tackled all of its threats so far. So far. Provided you do not turn against them violently, they will not actually attack you. They are too afraid of you. That's good. We have no intention of hurting them. We want to help them if we can. There's no way that we could have caused this plague that's afflicting them. This must be the work of Actopot. And yet the people do not see it. It is easier to blame something that is there in front of you than the true threat that is unseen. We should explore more of the village. Be quick about it. While we may not be in actual danger, we're not welcome here. The small child seems to like us. The small child has not been conditioned to hate us. Time has not worn away at his youthful conviction. And I'm glad for that. Hey ya folks, it's Kikoskia here, and welcome back to Let's Play Ravenloft Stone Prophet. And when last we left off, we found the village and did a good deed. We're trying to find the wife of the person who gave us the sack of provisions. We've not found them, though we have found a beggar who gave us their blessing because we gave them a kind word. We do not uh, fear them as the villagers fear him. Also, it's getting dark, but we can keep exploring around. I don't think the uh, important NPCs will uh, go to sleep. Also, there is a lot of stuff in here. Maybe I could, like, take a water skin and give the water skin to a uh, to the uh, beggar. I should keep that in mind for um, when we go into a dungeon. That's what I should do. Also, the water is going down quite quickly. Gotta be mindful of that. Let's actually rest in here, the uh, tent we just uh, went into. Because we do not have create food and water, do we? No, we do have create water. Okay, we do have create water. Good. Also, I should probably change the things you have memorized. Okay, that's the wrong spell list, me. There is not create water there. There is create water here. We want a create water. And instead of that, I don't think we want invisibility to undead. I want to create water instead of that. So, we'll have two of them. We're probably going to be resting a fair bit more than we were in uh, Strahd's possession, purely because of the need for water. Hey, if we beat a desert troll, they won't need water. Presuming, of course, we can have a desert troll in the party. Hello! You are not someone we can talk to. The fact that they've mentioned desert trolls either tells us that uh, we're going to be fighting a lot of them, or that knowledge of their vulnerabilities is going to be important for other reasons. There's an NPC out there, but probably not someone we have to worry about talking to. Oh, it's getting really dark. It is getting really dark, and there is the moon. Ah, hello. How are you? Not happy. The strongest rays of the sun could not brighten the gloom of this place. How might we lend our open hands to ease such suffering? Reach out no hand to me, or I shall strike it from you. Hand and foot, you have no business here, nor does my heart have room enough for welcome. Be gone, strangers in Harlequin. Always the cursed strangers come, then the storms rise, the sand blade-like whirls, and death comes. The flesh corrupts and falls away. You are distraught, my friend. We seek nothing more than information. It seems the heat has dried up all hospitality. Har Akir holds no place for the likes of you. Go, find shelter beneath the desert stones. Pay your gold to the scorpions, your hosts. The wrath of Angtopod settles round you like a shroud. Its shadows touch us all. In the shadow of that shroud, in the cloth itself, my wife 
lies dying. See your handiwork, the dark corruption your open hand offers. Apologies for upsetting you. May we offer aid to your wife, your child? Offer aid? You, whose very appearance shall destroy us all, how is it you might offer aid? You have awakened the wrath of Angtopoth, and he punishes us all for it. My daughter, you have frightened her and made things all the worse for your words. Mother is sick. P Papa says you, you brought the sick, you brought the sick. We brought no sickness with us. If only we could help. Papa, Mama, please make the strangers go away. Make the sickness go away. Make it go away. Make it go away. I, I won't listen anymore. I won't listen. I won't. You can't make me. You can't catch me. No, you can't catch me. Little one. Kineta, my precious, where are you going? Come back! Oh, by the gods, what have you done to me? Destroyer of families! Uh-oh. Worry not, children often flee when voices rise. We will trouble you no more, and seeing us leave, she will return. Will she return? Would you hurry back to a house touched by plague? Here her mother lies stricken by the wrath of Angtopot, and you the cause. This house is cursed. She shall run until the desert greets her and cuts her down. My precious, my daughter, lost to me. Leave here, go, or may all the evils of Har Arkir descend upon you. We have to find her. We will. She can't have gone far. Okay, so... That girl has run off! We are gonna have to make a note of, uh... Missing daughter. And hopefully... This is not like a timed thing of me. It probably isn't a timed thing of me. We're gonna make a save. And we're gonna keep exploring around. Hopefully we can find her soon. She won't have gone far. She can't have gone far. This place is too dangerous. Okay, and here we have nothing. We can mark this one as explored and not important. Look at me marking down things on a map, being sensible. There's nothing in here. We've not found the person we want to find yet. We will. We will. There's a tent here. Let's explore the outer tent first. Hello. How are you? May we speak with you? Hospitality seems as rare as the spring rain in this land. If you would have kind words, then join with me in asking the gods to spare my husband. If you do not care for such prayers, then you have no business here. Unless he returns soon, I shall have no need of words, kind or otherwise. Ah, we found her. Tell us of your husband. What threatens him so? Weak-hearted. Such a fool he is. Still, the others talked and talked before he agreed to go. Someone from among us, they said, had to plead with the lord of the land. End these storms, he would say to Antipat. Leash in the dogs of plague and death you have sent upon us. Ah, oh, the rotting disease will take us all. Perhaps Antipat would listen. Perhaps not. But someone had to try. A very brave thing to do. Speak as if your life, too, is threatened. If your husband does not return, how might you survive? I am alone. He... He took all of our supplies and marched away on a fool's quest. What choice did he have? In that sack lay everything. 
all we had. Without it, I shall have no strength to continue. Please, bother me no more. Some say you are the cause of it all, that the wrath of Anthropot was awakened because of you. Harsh as this land is, our words may prove harsher still. We came upon your husband as he lay dying. His last words were of you, pleading that we return these, your supplies. The sand shall be the grave of us all. Oh, my dear, sweet fool, my husband. And stranger though you be, you have given me back a chance at life, as would he if only. I shall set my prayers before the gods, that you may escape this horrid land. Oh, the fate of strangers in Harakir. Be well. I hope life treats you kinder in the future. You've done a good thing. You continue to do good things to the people of Harakir, despite their open hostility. It is our nature to help others, regardless of how they feel about us. That is a good and noble outlook. Indeed. We've got to keep exploring, though. We'll mark this as supplies, just in case we ever need to come back here. I doubt we will. Let's keep exploring the remaining, uh, places. Yeah, a place here. And there's a stranger. They're a stranger to us, we're a stranger to them. And they don't want us here, so we will not linger. We have a couple more places to explore. And there's that here. I think we're back in the, yeah, we're back in the center of the village. Uh, there's you, and nothing of a special interest there. There are a couple more huts. Um, yeah, there's a little eye there. I wonder what the eye is. Oh, those are the objects. Those are the objects that uh, we left behind. I'm like, what are those things? Oh yeah, the the couple of things that. Uh, person we escorted had. Okay, here is a scroll of blur. We don't need that. Good that it's here, though. And a scroll of armor. We don't need that either. But again, good that it's here. This is very close to the uh, wells. You can always just pop here and get some... Ooh, lightning. We should probably not stay outside with this lightning here. I doubt it will hit us. We should still be careful. It's getting very dark. At least it's colder. Right, we still have a couple of... Ooh, you can hear the, uh, the thunder. Okay, nothing here but some water skins. And I don't need water skins. So, do that there, and one more place to look. Here. And here is just a person. Okay. Here's just a person. There is... I was expecting to find the, uh... the person who the dagger belonged to. We've not found them yet. We've explored every single place. Let's, let's rest. Let's rest. Okay. It's, uh, it's day. We weren't killed by the storm, but oh my, is it hot. Right. We need to find... Where? Okay, there's... That's a place we've already explored. Ooh, there's another tent here. Okay, there's a tent here. All the way out here. And there is someone here that we can talk to. How do I know? Unique Sprite. How goes it? Come closer. Are you... Are you truly? Yes, a foreigner. Stranger to Harakir. I, Piotr, welcome you. 
I welcome you as though the sun rises in your heart and the cool moon proclaims us brothers. Now I know we are not alone, my sister and myself. These harakiri prove dull company. The lucky have the wit of camel masters. The rest cringe in terror at the slightest stirring of the sand. Ah. Yeah, I have some bad news for you. You have the look about you. Familiar. You have a sister, you say. And brothers too, though I fear for their souls. Their bodies are no longer to be worried over, for their dispirited, rotted flesh has left their bones. Only jackals have use for their remains. We are the Stani. Gypsies, some call us wanderers. For so long Barovia was our home, the mists our ally. We drew our wagons where we would, and the fogs, deadly to others, bothered us not. Ah, so you're from Barovia! Aha! Well, this is a nice little callback to the previous game. You speak of mists of the fog. Did you become lost in its unwelcome patterns? Yes, we became lost. If when lost one trades mountains cool and snow-capped for the burning sands of Harakir. From his castle heights the Lord of Barovia called the Vistani friend. Here the dull witch shun every soul not as dull as their own. And the rotting disease spreads. It comes upon you like a hot wind right through the walls of your soul it comes. My brothers and the others with us, they felt it. The hot touch of death. We must tell you, your appearance is familiar because we have encountered your sister. She is dead. The same fate as your brother's. If the wrath of a flea might fell a camel, then my wrath be upon Ongdapat. My sister! I had not seen her. I... She often stole away from us, alone. She would journey into the sands, seeking a way out of Harakir for us. Her magic was one to command the mist, and she blamed herself for bringing us here. Now it is all but done. Only I remain. Ah, such a terrible affliction, the rotting disease. Now all but one of our band has been brought down by it. So the villagers of Muhar are affected as well. And they blame the Vistani for bringing the disease among them? It is difficult to say what they believe. Though generally it is this. The lord of the land, Hongtapot, stirs in his ancient sleep. He is a mummy. Wrapped as much in evil as in cloth. Though the cloth has tattered, the evil has not. It is he who sends the fierce storms across the land. Perhaps it is he who has released this strange rotting affliction. Yet what has drawn this creature's attention? Stirred his wrath. In the eyes of the villager it was once the Vistani. Now that we are gone, it could be you. I hesitate, but I must ask this of you. When you found her remains, my sister, did you find as well a certain dagger? It is strange to ask, I know, yet this blade of which I speak was the one symbol of our family. An heirloom, if you will. Whoever leads our family is charged with keeping it. Now I am leader and family both, all wrapped up in one sorry spirit. The blade, do you know of it? Here is the dagger of which you speak. We found it near the bones of your beloved sister. May you keep it as well honed as did she. My thanks. With this dagger I feel as a bloom in the desert, given life by he who waters it, yet unable to do more than accept the gift. Yet how much longer can I hope to survive myself? Oh, please allow me to join with you, whatever you are about. I shall make myself as useful as rain in the desert. And it cut off there for some reason? Interesting. But we are potentially going to have a new companion. And someone from Barovia at that. Will you join with us? We hold Harakir as dear as death itself. I am with you. By the blood of my Vistani brothers, Harakir shall not hold us long. Excellent! We have you! You are pretty well equipped. Leather armor. Vistani dagger. Short sword? Well, Vistani dagger for you. And the dagger of throwing. And a ring of protection. You can have this ring of res fire resistance as well. Excellent. We have a new companion. Also, have this chain help. 
It's not going to protect you, but uh, actually this will protect you. And it's even appropriate for your uh, armor. And so when we come back, folks, we have a companion. We have you. If I swap things around like that. Can you not dual wield? This is an interesting question. Can you not dual wield? Or can you not use the Vistani dagger? Huh. Can you not actually use the dagger? I don't know, but right now that is not high. Ah, is this ah, is this because you are in the back and thus can't use it because you are yeah, that's probably it. That's probably it. Either way, when we come back, folks, we will move out with a new companion. Someone who is not a commoner and thus has more than five hit points. And someone from Barovia. Perhaps we can yet save another person who was previously in Strahd's realm. This time, from a completely different Lord of Dread. And so... I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later.